Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to the week. God's blessings to you and your home church as we celebrate his blessings and ours. We're going to look for a few days at Romans chapter 9, uh, the first part, verses 1 through 5, and then we're going to kind of go into the latter part of the chapter. I'm absolutely intrigued that Paul talks about having this great burden for his kinsmen. And he talks about in those first few verses, as we talked about yesterday at church, how the Jews had, had every, every reason uh, to believe that Jesus was the Messiah. I mean, they had the history, they had the patriarchs, they had the law, they had the ceremony, they had, had the worship. They had all of these things that pointed towards Christ, and yet they rejected him. And Paul has a burden about that. In fact, in the first few ver verses, he says, look, I, I would hypothetically give up my own salvation so that they could believe if that's what it would take. And of course, Paul couldn't offer that. But he never, ever, ever uh, got away from that burden. In fact, you'll notice that when he, whenever he established a church uh, in Acts, that we see that he always started in the Jewish synagogues and preached Christ. And then when they ultimately rejected the gospel and Paul, then he would turn towards the Gentiles. Now, our assignment for this week is to think about the burdens for particular people that God has laid on our heart and to pray for them and to think of those opportunities that God might give to us to share the gospel with them. Let's pray about that. So Father, this is a week full of possibilities. Open our hearts and open our eyes to see where you will lead us in sharing the gospel. And we pray that in Jesus' name, amen. See you tomorrow, everybody.